just want to take a moment to show you my home emergency battery bank and here you can see it's in operation right now it's been charged up by the ship to shore Schumacher uh, 15 amp charger it charges this battery bank is uh, it's powered by two 150 amp batteries giving me 300 amp hours of batteries also I have here two inverters two Cobra inverters one is 400 watts and another one here is 800 watts in the background you can see my uh, printer and the laptop I also have an external 12 volt battery meter you can see the current charge of the, uh, the system as well as uh, a USB uh, charger right here with a nice blue lit up uh, accessory this battery bank is also powered with a standby 13 watt 12 volt uh, lighting system and usually I keep this on to let me know that the battery is uh, fully charged and if this light ever comes off or turns off that tells me that the battery is the batteries themselves have discharged and, be a, and there may be an issue okay I also have a another uh, 75 watt inverter that plugs in directly into this four-way uh, DC output so when you're charging uh, smaller items like a TV uh, DVD players and what have you you can use the uh, 700 watt inverter no need to turn on the the bigger wattage uh, inverters uh, to run the system now again the beauty of this system is that it is being charged continuously with a battery charger right now this particular battery charger is in maintain mode and it will keep the batteries at a float at float charge right now you see the current charge is 13.2 volts and that will stay that way as long as the battery charger is charged up and it acts almost like a a solar panel so whenever you you lose your home power your system is fully charged it kicks in and it, it goes to work for you again I have three two 150 amp batteries they're hooked up in parallel and this system here I've tested it and it gives me more than 48 hours of continuous power running a television DVD player my laptops I can charge all of my cell phones, my tablets, uh, run the lights for emergency for a full 48 hours. And you can get all the details on how to set this system up at our website. And this link will be at the, um, at the end of the video. But, but once again, an excellent system, fully charges in case you lose power from a storm or a tornado or something like that you can have this system inside your house this home emergency backup battery bank and the good thing about this system is it's flexible you can you can continue to add on batteries to give you more standby power you can add on bigger inverters you can add the bigger inverters onto the system uh, if you want to run, the re uh, obviously you want to run a refrigerator, uh, you can add a bigger inverter onto the system. Unlike the other other uh, battery banks or solar uh, solar power banks, they're limited. You can't increase the battery uh, output. You're fixing the uh, the the um, the type of inverters that you have. This system is a standalone, put together system, and it can advance based on your own personal needs your own personal needs again that's our uh, 12 volt DC battery meter 
that gives me it lets me know what is the voltage of this system as we're running it as it's being run all right so in emergency time you can you can hook your, you can have your television so you can keep in contact with the news um, you can have your DVD players for uh, for the kids uh, to keep them busy you can run your computers you have your internet you have the whole system set up for you guys the whole system uh, I just wanted to show you this and let you see it's in, how it's in operation and uh, every home should have one of these set up every home should have one of these set up for standby emergency power okay if you have any questions you can always email me from the website and I uh, look forward to talking to you uh, soon. I'll, I'll put a video together on how to actually install one of these. Very, sim very simple system for installation uh, purposes. You can have it set up in your house. I would say in less than, less than uh, 15 to 20 minutes. Doesn't take long to put this, to get, put this system together um, and have it operational for you. Alright, talk to you guys later. Have a good one.